welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a clothes haul i absolutely love filming these these are my favorite videos to do love getting the stuff and i love filming them and i love wearing this stuff um this a lot of this stuff is stuff that i wore in turkey so i probably should have filmed this video before i went out um, but I didn't get a chance to, so I'm doing it now. Um, all of the items are from Shein, and I will link them below. You guys know how much I love Shein. I get their stuff all the time. Um, but this time, I got some shoes, which I don't normally get. So I'm going to start off by showing you guys them. So the first pair is literally just like this basic crisscross um, flat sandals. They were really, really comfy. These were literally like my go-to sandals when I was in um, Istanbul because it was so hot and they were literally so comfy. You could wear them the whole day. Um, and then I got these, which look really worn because I wore them loads as well. But they're really, I just thought they were really, really pretty. Um, they're just these white sandals with um, flowers and pearls. You guys know how much I love pearls and that's the hill on them. Um, and I just thought it was nice, Just sometimes it's nice just to have a little bit of a heel so that you've got some height because when you're 5'2 like me, any height will help. Um, but yeah, these were the second pair that I got and they were really, really comfy. I can't remember exact names and prices so I will try and do like a little um, banner at the bottom every time I talk about something so that you guys know what it's called and how much it is. Um, and then I've got another couple here. That I haven't worn yet, and that these first ones I am so excited to wear. Um, these are like the black ones that they have in Zara at the moment, but they're white. Um, and then they're just they're just three straps, and all of the straps have got pearls on them, and they're so pretty. Um, and they've got a little bit of a heel as well. And then the final pair, they have some really really nice shoes on the Shein website, actually. If I'm honest, I think I might get some more next time. Guys, how much I love shoes. Um, and then the final pair of these, I don't know how I feel about them. I really like them when I ordered them. Um, I like the block heel because obviously it's going to be comfortable and a strap. I'm not sure how I feel about this at the front. Like it's quite quirky. I liked it because of the pearl. Um, and I think they will look cute on. But you know when like you get something, and you're like you want to try it because it looks cute. But then like when it comes, you're like. Oh, I'm not sure it's my style. That's how I feel about these. So I will wear them and see how they look once I wear them. Um, and then I've got a couple of bags. Really, really cute bags. Um, both exactly the same. So this is the first one. And I wore this out a lot as well when I was in Istanbul, actually, because it was just so convenient. Because I would literally throw it over. But it's um, it's a bit of a Chloe dupe, actually. Um, it's got a chain. And the chain is really super heavy. Um, and then it's got like these um, saddle handles here and then a lock. Um, it is quite small but I think it's like pretty convenient just for like money, keys and phone. Um, and I've been like loving smaller bags more recently. I think I'm just like fed up with like carrying huge bags around with me. Especially like because I carry my makeup and other crap that I never actually even use. Um, so that's why I'm preferring smaller bags. But this is um, like a cream ivory colour. Um, and then I got like a yellow mustard colour just because a lot of the outfits that I wore out in Istanbul um, were yellow slash mustard so I thought it would look nice um, but I didn't actually end up wearing it just because guys it was so hot whilst we were in Turkey that I just couldn't be bothered with anything like if you look at all my pictures from Turkey I'm not showing my face in any of them because I didn't wear any makeup the whole time we were there <laughs> um, but yeah this is the other one I think it's really really cute and actually it'll look really nice in the autumn with like plum coloured outfits um, and then moving on to the clothes that I wore I will try and show you guys pictures because um, a few of these things obviously I wore so I have pictures in them the first one is this top it's um, a blue navy top with white lace crochet detail and then um, it's got like the bell sleeves and the lace detail on the sleeves and obviously I liked it because the sleeves are really in um, and it's just really lightweight um, and I just paired it with a pair of uh, palazzo pants and it was super super comfy and I find that like loose clothes like this are always better in um, hot summery weather. Um, I also got this jacket just because the print and the coins kind of reminded me of a Turkish design. That's the print on the front and the coins and then this is the sleeves and it's got coins as well and then the back. Um, and literally this is really good because it's so lightweight 
um, that I literally just wore like a uh, vest top and palazzo pants underneath and then just threw this on top. Material of this is super light so what I did was I paired it with a vest top and palazzo pants because what I find really difficult is in the hot weather I want to wear like strapless tops or vest tops and obviously they need to be covered up because of my hijab um, and it kind of defeats the purpose when you're wearing like a strappy vest top and then you pair it with like a cardigan and then the cardigan makes you super hot and then you're like what's the point I should have just worn a long sleeve top. Um, that's when things like this come in really handy just because it's so lightweight that once you've got it on top it doesn't even feel like you're wearing anything. Um, I got another similar jacket like that in mustard um, and that's what it looks like and it's got like um what is this tassels tassel sleeved and then tassels at the bottom um but it was cute because it was it had bits of blue in it as well and obviously like I had blue outfits, so I was like, yeah, it'll go, it'll go with the rest of my outfits. Um, same thing with this. I think I chucked this on top of a white skirt. Got a picture. It's not a very clear picture because um, the focus was the mosque in the picture rather than my outfit. Um, but I'm wearing it in that. And once again, this was super, super lightweight. It felt like I was wearing, like, hardly anything. Um, I also got a few other things that I didn't take with me just because when I got them, I didn't realise how hot it was going to be in Turkey. Um, so I ended up not taking these things with me. The first one, I'm really excited to wear this. I don't know when I'm going to wear it. It's this dress, guys. It's so pretty. I want to cry. I might wear it today. I'm not even going anywhere today. It's just so cute. Um, it's like a black net dress. Um, and then it's got red and cream flowers on it. Embroidered. Um, and then green embroidery. And it's got a zip at the back and then it's got, um a seam down the middle so that it's like quite fitted um, and I'll probably just wear this with a black midi dress underneath and then leggings um, but it's just so like nice and elegant and it's good because it's full coverage um, and I just thought it was really really pretty um, and I got a couple of other lace things as well I like lace me. Um one of them is not here so give me one second and I will go grab it I can't seem to find the other kimono, which is what happens when I delay filming. Um, but I will stick a picture in of it so you guys can see what it looks like. But it's literally just some white lace um, open jacket kimono thing. And it's so cute. I think it will look so pretty with just like a white top and a pair of jeans. Um, and I just really, really liked it. I was going to take it to Istanbul with me, but like I said, it was just too hot. So I didn't. But it's great for UK weather. Um, and then I also got this, which is a white lace dress. Um, it is see-through. Um, it's kind of similar to the black one that I wore at um, Modernisa Fashion Week, which I really, really loved. Um, but I just need to get like a white bodycon dress to wear underneath it. This is what the sleeves are like, so they're slightly loose. Um, and it's a it's a loose dress overall, so it's really great because if I pair it with no focus, if I pair it with um, a white bodycon dress and then white leggings, um, it's still like loose and full coverage. Oh, look really pretty um i don't know what scarf i'd wear it with maybe nude and nude heels or maybe white i don't know but i just really like that then i got a white another white kimono um but this one is um got embroidery on it so yes that's what the sleeves look like they've just got like red and green and yellow flowers on them um, and then it's got flowers all the way down there as well and then like lace at the bottom um, not lace tassels at the bottom I just thought it was really nice to wear in the summer um, it's really lightweight so I wouldn't even feel like I was wearing it and I could pair it with like her maxi skirt or maxi dress um, and just the flower print was just so pretty and then the final thing that I got was um, this skirt once again, floral skirt for the summer. Just thought it would be really nice. I didn't take it to Istanbul with me just because of the material. It's like a chiffon material. And I just thought, I'm going to get too hot in it um, out there. Um, but it's, like I said, it's perfect for wearing in the UK. And that's what it looks like. It is um, a shorter at the front. Um, and once upon a time, I would have really minded that. Um, but now I don't mind so much. I just wear it with leggings. And sometimes I would even like to pull it up and wear it as like a dress. Um like a, a, a midi midi length dress like if I wore it up here and um, then it would just come to my knees and I can just pair it with leggings and I'll like, just stick on a cardigan on top um, so yeah I really like that 
that is basically everything that I got as part of this haul. If you guys have any questions, leave them down below. I get so many questions about my outfits on Instagram and literally like 90% of the time my outfits, unless I say it's from a company in the caption, most of the time they're from Shein. They have some really, really nice stuff. I know people get really funny about ordering from them just because they think that because the videos are sponsored, I might not be telling the truth or I might not like the stuff. Guys, if you look at my Instagram stuff, I'm literally wearing Shein all the time. Um, and if it was crap, I wouldn't, I wouldn't promote them. Like, I, I have never promoted any of the flat tea stuff, so I've never promoted any of, like, um, the coffee scrubs or anything like that because I don't believe in that kind of stuff. Like, I don't use it. I don't really believe it works. Um, whereas these clothes, I really love these clothes, and I genuinely think that you guys should shop from there because it's such a cool website, and they have an amazing, amazing selection of stuff. Literally, they have, like, hundreds of thousands of items and they've always got new items coming in so yeah and um, the only annoying thing about the website is that they take forever to deliver literally deliveries take like anywhere between two to three weeks to sometimes i've waited like six weeks so it can be annoying i get that um but it is a really cool website and i think you guys should check it out and if you have any questions leave them below and i'm just rambling now so i'll see you all soon